The plight and agony of the Lele Basa community in Kwali Area Council in Abuja has drawn the attention of the non-governmental organization Action Aid as the world marks the Social Justice Day. The 20th of February every year has been set aside by the United Nations in recognition of persons or communities who suffer injustices around the world and they need to draw attention to their plight. Plus TV Emmanuel Ehijene completes the story. Lele Basa community is situated along the Lokja Abuja Expressway in Kwali Area Council of the Federal Capital Territory. But despite its proximity to the seat of power, the area still looks remote with no visible infrastructure in sight, except for two structures housing a primary and secondary operating side by side. There are no roads, no health centre, nor any basic infrastructure. <laughs> The representative of the country director, Action Aid Nigeria, called on the government to build infrastructure for the people of Lele Basa so that they can also enjoy life like other communities. They also urged the CBN to rethink its caste swap policy, which has taken a negative toll on the people, especially the downtrodden in the country. In a similar vein, the project director, Action Aid, explained Lele Basa community was specifically selected for the event because it suffers from all forms of oppressions ranging from land grabbing to lack of basic infrastructure. This particular community where we are, land grabbing is a big issue. Government takes uh, land at will from people and um, they give this out to investors who are not even Nigerians. If we fix the rural communities and villages, you have many people staying back to till the land and get more people employed to ensure that there is high standard of living in the rural communities. We chose this community in Lelebasa to celebrate this event on two, on two reasons. The first reason is for the, for the world to see the kind of injustice, injustice meted out against communities who pay tasks, communities who also um, you know, perform their civic duties, but yet deprived of social amenities. Members of the community expressed joy by the visit with the hope that their cries will get to the authorities. We don't have farm to farm again because there are so many people where we are in the house like this, some people are in the farm selling our land. When they talk, they will say that it's from area council. When by it's a lie. Then they now collect all our land in the Lembasa. We don't have where to farm. Even this year, the way we used to farm and get some things, this year we don't get it like that because the farm is tired and we don't have money to buy fertilizer. Somebody do come and collect some land that they collect more than 100 acres, 150 acres. They collect the whole land. They say they bought it from the government. They will be saying that this one, if the people are not going to release the land, they will have issues with the people, they will see it to court. So some of those things, they will take our land now. Fortunately, as I'm talking to you, all the way from Pay Junction, from Junction there, that is Express Road, to down to Pay here. There is no free land that has not been occupied with people. This year's team is overcoming barriers and unleashing opportunities for social justice. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.